mystery. What are you blind? Why, you don't see there's a line? I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in? Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever the fuck you like. Yep. I work here. Especially if you're gonna treat and me like shit. Great work you do, sheriff. Hmm. That didn't feel very genuine. Fucker. I think I'm right. I Crane, Ichabod Crane, um, from from Sleepy Hollow. Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow, the one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. How? Do you understand me? Where yes, the hell am I? Don't know. interrupt me, Miss Snow. Oh, I'm you sorry. asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You are trusted to keep things running smoothly around here. This is a disaster. Back off, Ichabod. It's Yay, not her fault. I was right. I don't need your help, Bigby. Instead of trying to assign blame, maybe we should figure out how to catch the fucker who did this. Oh, says the man who is most to blame for this catastrophe. How convenient. Sheriff, you are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Man, you're anything, kind of a prick, aren't you? Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're doing. Because right now, I have half a mind to fire the both of you. Yeah. Her pen. Her... Was she, uh... Yeah. She was worried about a money situation. Well, this is just wonderful. Not only is a fable killed, but it was a fable hooker to boot. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. I mean, going by the archer school of thought, yeah. If they're dead, they're just hookers, stuff. apparently. Snow. Yes? Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my massage. I will. Hmm. Pause on the word massage. Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Man, this guy's a douche. Forget it. Do your job, Sheriff. Wasn't him, we'll was it? Someone who can. Uh, you know what? Stop. <laughs> we'll get on it right away. <laughs> They're a good team. You would have just pissed him off more. All right. <laughs> oh, I don't well, that could have gone better. Well, I guess I should have listened to you and waited. Wasn't gonna say I told you so. You don't have to say it. It would have been better to have more to offer. To get our ducks in a row. Oh, Crane doesn't like people smoking and... <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Smoke away. Uh, let's go with... That one. Wine to a massage? Probably a gift. The weird part of that is that he's actually being nice to someone. Yeah. I know I bought Massage. That Wink. Who or what is that? Is he gone? Is that one of yes, like the right? wicked witch's flying monkeys? Is he drunk? Buffkin. Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking this early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Rickabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably belongs to him? Yeah, but he's a prick. Maybe. The How eyebrow. Are you today, <laughs> the eyebrow raise of hmm. That's not a nice answer. I'm gonna go with I'm fine. Fine, Buffkin. Thanks for asking. Buffkin, Aww. get the books. Which books? The ones with all the fables in it. I'm not sure that was any more specific. Bring <laughs> the first three. Be back in a few minutes. Yeah, where the hell is this place? You got flying to ships, you've got bound to be information on her possibly Yggdrasil, somewhere. the world tree. We'll at least be able to get her possibly real name an airship whenever Buff can find them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. I really have you to think the magic mirror will look a bit better. Away, but let me know if you need anything. Okay. Hello, Ooh, magic lamp. Let's start on that. So who's Vivian? White, Let's keep an eye out. Oh. Magic lamps are pretty much just lamps after the genie's been freed. 
Can I rub it? Can I, can I, can I rub it? Let's wrap, let's wrap the lamp. Worth a try. <laughs> See, Big B gets me. Or is it I get Big B? Uh, oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, a tarot deck. I have the record right here. Give me one moment. Tarot cards. Jack brought them back from Appalachia. Who knows where they were before that? Or what he did to get them. Well, that's not what I have here. I wonder which Jack that means. Strength. I guess <laughs> it comes in all forms. I'll be sure to let him know. Strength. Tower. What's the final card? Death. Damn. Ten. What the sense. fuck is this supposed to mean? Okay. But kept that one. That's interesting. Let's have a look at the mirror. I wonder why he kept that one. Let's have a look at me scruffy beard. Talk to the mirror. Hey, magic mirror. I got a question. You know the rule. I don't have time for this <laughs> shit. Magic Your mirror on the wall? Is callow. You're needlessly cruel, but have some respect for our history and rules. <sighs> mirror, <laughs> mirror. Uh, if you're able, tell me all about this fable. He's got to make it right. So hard. <laughs> yeah, I'm about two seconds away from taking a hole in you. I really There's like no Big need for that. <laughs> Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. Okay, so let's try about... Buffkin? Show me Buffkin. Hey, put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. I'm about the woodsman. Show me the woodsman. Where is he? What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. No shit. Which street? <laughs> I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can't be seen. Interesting wording. Nobody writes. Okay. Very well, cool. please return should you wish to ask about someone else or someone new. Cool. <laughs> You'd love a drunk. <sighs> well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. Right, oh. Okay. You know what this means? Tarot is a backwards art. I wouldn't put too much stock in its wisdom, Bigby. Not when you've been so helpful. Prevision's muddy. I'm as clear as a wind. Funny how a... Like... Magical mirror isn't so keen on... Like, divination. <laughs> Divination may be the wrong word. I'm using the Harry Potter school of naming things, so I do apologise if that is incorrect. Can I like run? I can, I can kind of like shuffle a bit quicker. So we've got three books here. We got. Let's have a look at this big one that's already open. There might be a reason it's open. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. Shame you just can't control F the word prostitute. That's great. Yep, it's in Sleepy Hollow. Heads to the Horseman. Snow White, the Wolf, the Dwarves. I mean, I probably should be looking at multiple of these, but I just ah, oh, the crest. There you go. I've seen this before. This symbol on the man's clothes—it's the same as the rings. Could be her father. 
or husband. This has hmm. most of the emblems of the old days, and usually what family they come from. Well, I found what I was looking for. We'll have her name. Cool. So it's in that one, yeah? Is that what she was saying? Yeah, Book of Symbols. Alright, let's find out who she is. So is that Yggdrasil? Oh, great. What? I can't read any of this shit. I can help. Yeah, thanks. We look out for each other. I mean, it looks kind Don't of... Don't overdo it. Norse. Buffs. Translate. Hmm. An exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. Mr. Toad? He probably wrote this in himself. <laughs> uh, arrow keys change page. Same symbol that was on the Huntsman's this Axe. Familiar. Yes, from the Axe of the Woodsman, a druid blessing, actually. Someone blessed that thing. I only translate. Well, that's... What's it say about that? It says Bricklebit in an older elvish hand. What's Bricklebit? A magic word. What's it do? Makes animals shit gold. <laughs> the paws have just well that's the, the Jabberwock and the Vorpal Blade um, that's not the symbol I'm looking for although is that about Arthur? yeah okay uh, 13 Cinderella that's the one, there we go so whose symbol is that? And that appears to be Robin Hood. Cool. This is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alairlairo? I'll go look it up. Alairlairo. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? <sighs> donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin. <laughs> Also known as <laughs> Askin. <laughs> really, that Buffkin? to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. Oh. The story of Donkey Skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was uh, his daughter. Faith. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Right. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. We got what we came for. Yeah. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than her we... name was Faith. Yeah. We should Who's talk Prince to the Lawrence? husband. Let's you go find Prince it? Lawrence. Bacon. Nothing would surprise me at this point. We can't rule him out. Good detective work, Big B. Right, uh... How do I do that? Oh, let's see if there's anything else in here that might give me a clue about maybe the Ten of Swords. So we will send around there. We've got Robin Hood. Oh, as far as it goes. Okay, in which case... I guess I can walk a bit quicker now. Oh. Let's go shuffle around the room. There we go. There we go. On our way. Right, so if I know about that, I can maybe. Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, able, blah, blah, blah about this fable. <laughs> of which fable? He just do you doesn't wish really care, know? does he? Uh, so let's try 
Prince Lawrence. He's a prince, I think. Let's see Prince Show Lawrence. me Prince Lawrence. Oh God, has he killed What's himself? He doing? Where is this? Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. All right. Uh, Faith's father, maybe. Show me Faith's father, the old king. Oh. Guess that crosses him off the suspect list. Yeah, probably a good one. So I click Faith, show so it's going to show me. Show me Faith. Through powerful magic, her whereabouts can Oh, right. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. What? These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing, really. It's simply the way this has to be. Okay, that's interesting. Anything we can use? Yeah, uh -uh. that'll have to do for now. Come on, we're going over there. Sorry, I have to get that. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I... He is. Hold on. Bigby, it's for you. Someone knows I'm here, obviously. Bigby, it's me. Oh. Okay. You there? Uh, what's up? What do you want? Big B. Shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. Oh, Get shit. over here, Big B, before he. Oh, well, hang on. Boy, shit. Hey! What was that about? Hard to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. And we should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. Whenever you're ready. Why couldn't that just, why couldn't it just done it for me? What else am I gonna do while I'm here? Oh like then all fairness. That might be my my downfall just then. Probably could have looked around a bit further, but Oh well, it's definitely too late now. Did Toad say who was there? Was it the woodsman? I don't know, it's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. Well, maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, he didn't see him. He could use some help, too. Well, so you have a drunk, or... or... Dad? Big, big shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Oh man, don't like choices. If I go see Toad, I'm hoping that means Snow will go and see Lawrence. Toad sounds like he needs help right Glass now. Glass shoes. Okay, she's coming with me. Prince Lawrence out. Okay, I'm not looking forward to breaking the news to him anyway. Hey guys, Swanky Jack here. Thanks for watching this episode of The Wolf Among Us. There's going to be new episodes of that every day at the same time. And if you've enjoyed it, like the video and subscribe for more daily content. If you've got any feedback or suggestions for future videos, give me a shout in the comment section below. Or give me a shout on Twitter or Facebook. The links for which will be in the description below. Also in the description, you'll find a link to Miracle of Sound's song, A Dog's Life, which I used for the intro of this video. Miracle of Sound is one of my favourite musicians in the world. And if you'd like to hear more of his content, by all means, follow the link in the description to more of his stuff, because he is absolutely amazing. So until then, thanks for watching and have a fantastic day. I'll see you later. Bye!